By contributing to the Neuroverse testnet, you would be able to get some free crypto airdrop reward at launch when they get to the minute and I am gonna show you step by step how. If you're interested in this particular testnet airdrop that you could easily get between $50 to $100 or more for participating in, then you're at the right video. We should confirm that you're gonna get rewarded as it says you're gonna earn rewards that is for receiving points for all quests and actions that you do and you claim the leaderboard you're gonna get rewarded for that so let's begin if you find the video that you're watching right now useful then you can support the channel by subscribing to it i would also appreciate if you can turn on the notification bell to all this way, whenever I post a video, you are going to get a notification of it. You can support the video further by liking and also dropping a comment if you have any question. The first step will be to check out the link that I'll leave at the description of the video and when you click on it, it will take you right here where you have to first of all sign in. So, you can do this using your wallet which I'll suggest. Click on continue with your wallet. So for me, I'm gonna use my Metamax. I'll then click on to connect. You have to sign the verification. Click on to confirm. Once you have done that, this is now your wallet and you're good to go. Once you come here to the top, you can see that these are all of what you have to do to get the airdrop. It is basically the testnet, so you must be active. You should breach. You should use the explorer. You should claim the facets, the validator house, leaderboard, exchange, and by doing all of this, you're gonna get rewarded. So just click on to collect pulse. Currently, it says unable to collect it, but you should always click on to collect it. But now let's just click on the facet. You have to open the facet. This is your personal wallet. You have to click on to claim the tokens. It is processing your token claim that has been successful, and you have received three A and K arrow. This is actually the test net A and K arrow, and you have to come in the next 24 hours to claim more. So the next step will be for you to breach okay so what you have to do will be to come over to the breach currently we have the three a and k our test net token so we have to bridge from this to this so let's click on max but then all you got to do will be to come down and click on to breach at your wallet you have to confirm this and approve the token transfer it says you do not have enough so you need some sepolia ethereum free to be able to do this thing of that so this one is not going to be successful because i don't have any right now you can just decide to switch this as well you can just be bridging this way you've done your second activity you should do this every single day you can see how small the fee actually is so make sure you deposit some sepolia ethereum that you can be using for the fee so that's the second activity we have tried out though it wasn't successful but here's the explorer at this explorer you can always connect your wallet first of all click on approve so now you have connected your wallet and every time you maybe copy out your wallet and probably use your explorer to search for the address or whatever address that you want to search for you're making an activity come right here you're gonna see five minutes ago the particular transaction that i did and there's a validator house at this validator house you can click on to chat and yeah you're basically interacting with the ai let's say i send hi for an example it says i have reached my limit and i'm not going to be able to send another message for some reason it is saying this but you can come and interact with this as well to increase your airdrop reward so that's it for the validator house and the little board yeah it takes us to the point center where we can see our points but you're only going to get points for doing all the stacks that i told you about remember i used the facet so you have collected 40 points for that click on to claim the 40 points and that way you have claimed it successfully so every time you interact with the neuroverse you have to come and claim a reward for logging in for the day you're gonna get 10 points this point will then give you the airdrop let's say we actually did some breach just as you can see we could have gotten 40 points for that as well so I'm going to claim the 10, so 5 days activity, you're going to get 25. If you visit all maps, location, in a week, you're going to get 25, and so on. So coming down below, you're going to see that the first person is having just 755 points, meaning 
this airdrop hasn't started long enough so you can keep doing tasks interacting to get rewarded and once you come right here to the history you're gonna see how you're getting the reward that's for this one and then finally we do have the exchange so you have to confirm when you want to access this and yeah at this section you'll be able to sell the a and k out that you do have so take note that this is gonna be their official token you have to sign in if you haven't signed in so whatever amount that you do have you'll be able to sell it right here and then you have interacted with this one as well and all of these are gonna give you the airdrop and according to the tokenomics they are gonna be listing at least two tokens first is gonna be the a and k arrow so there will be a total of 10 billion and they are also gonna list this particular one too which is gonna be a native gas asset so yeah we are gonna get an airdrop in return at the minute all important updates concerning the new protocol will be posted in my telegram channel so do well to join it with the link below